Come on, open the doors, will you? Yeah, it's kind of like we're at the steakhouse. How do I always get stuck in the middle? And who had garlic? Joe. Yes. It had to be Wadler. Somebody had garlic. Right, drop the keys. Is the ring picking up again? Here, give me the keys. Yeah, here you go. Practicing for what? Keeping my name out of your mouth. Keeping my... Hey! I'm just saying, you run in your mouth a lot. Well, Dad, the good news is the rain should get most of it off. Did you get the core? That is true. I actually hope it starts. Oh, yeah, I gotta get the core. I actually hope it starts. That was your idea. All right, and that was my idea. That was your idea. And then. They're getting the cooler. And then when it didn't work out for you, you conveniently threw it on me. Stop it, dude. That's okay, though, Joe. Stop it. If that makes you feel better, if that's what you need. I just need you to Dude, keep my name out of your I mouth. I guess I'm just, just that guy. Tonight. What's going on here? Tonight. Yeah. Yeah, what are you doing? I don't know. Joe said something and then Weber started going Weber, off. What happened to the back of your leg? That was from mountain biking. It's always from I mountain believe biking it. with this guy. Dude, I hope I'm invited back there, in the area. by the way. Mountain biking? I mean, that was a poor shower. If I could hear you one more time about being invited back somewhere, I, I, I mean, I meet these guys at a party it's awesome they're like come over and then that was a bad showing that was the worst because every idea yeah. that originated from was a mistake oh, i agree oh i need a beer and a piece of pizza this guy right you have a beer and a pizza over here you run your mouth We'll take we'll one. You know, Joe, we <laughs> learned. Double on my head. We, Joe, we you learned. You want a beer? Yeah. Admitting our Weber's mistakes. getting his beers. Weber, we'll take one. Oh, wow. Okay, guys, you want one? I'll get you one. Uh, this guy helps I'll himself. Take Weber, I'll take one. Thank you, buddy. Joe, you want a beer? Never no, I'm good. For you, sir. No, thank you. Joe doesn't want one. Oh, here, here you go. That was. Thanks, buddy. That was what? That was a mistake. I, I don't. It wasn't a big deal. If Terry was in there blowing everybody's seat, it wouldn't have been a big deal at all. We went over there asking a few questions. It wasn't a big deal. Jeff wasn't upset about it at all. I don't know what the big deal is. You never worry you about your street rep or street cred. It's ridiculous. Like, we went over there, we had no nothing to do with that. I mean, why just, wouldn't we think it was but, him? But Terry makes sense. No. Well, I, she is defensive. I didn't, I didn't even think that we were. I, like, whoever said anything to Jeff, I didn't think it was bad. I didn't think that anybody said anything that. Should have been like. So it wasn't the end of the world. I just don't know them no, enough don't like that to, to be put into that situation. That's more, you know. No, 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 I'm saying. Should be so. fine by Monday, dude. If not, then that's her fault. It's not like I've chummed it up with them like a hundred times. That was like the third time I've like hung. I mean, I don't know. You should worry about your rep for, dude. You're a cool dude. Everybody likes you. There's nothing to do with rep. Like, we just. Yeah, we I, came into the house hot. No, you just got Jeff. Off. I thought we were kind of. Yeah, not nah. cool at the beginning because I thought it was like we were all trying to be like. If what if Terry uh, escalated the situation? It would have been fine. It would have been fine. If she wasn't there, nobody would have felt. That's her house. house. I mean, I don't blame her. her. She had defensive with her husband, but she had defensive when Larry asked her questions at the shop too. She's had she not been sitting there, I don't think we would have had a problem. Yeah, it would have been super easy. It would have been a big deal at all. Exactly. I think they handled it well. We went there. We were one beer each. It's it was like, smart. We didn't try to ever say a welcome. Yeah. I felt like it was a good visit. The problem was that Terry got all defensive and bought her. Yeah, she was. I'm gonna have to text Jay today. I don't. What are you gonna say? But like, hope like your parents aren't mad. Like that was. Why is it so important that JT's parents like you? I don't think they're mad. It's not important. It's just. I think Terry might be I mean, mad, but I don't think JT. And none of them are I mad just, at you. That's how I was yeah. raised. None, just, none, none, none of them are mad at you. Because because I, I, we no, talk, I, I just hit my Kevin, I'll be honest with you. I don't think you made a bad pressure about, at all. No, hold on. Let me finish. I don't think you made a bad pressure at all on anybody. I mean, even when you were there, even if it, it was in the best situation, you were fine. You didn't say anything wrong. You didn't make I a bad pressure. I barely said anything. So I don't think that you need to worry about it. I understand where you're coming from, but there's no reason Like, I'm your accomplices at this point. Like, they know. No, Terry knows how her brother is and how I am. Like, you know, it's, if we're gonna get the What's heat, that supposed to mean? Because she's known you here your entire life. But what did I do? All I did was went over there. Why do you see you so mad at you? Said she knows how you. I was saying, she, if she doesn't think anything bad about anybody from tonight, it's gonna be uh, me and you, not him. Well, no, I don't think she's gonna have a problem. That's all. That's all I was right. saying. That's oh all yeah, I was we're saying. gonna be the bad guys. In that's this. exactly. Okay, that's exactly what I was saying. Yeah, yeah, I agree that's with all. you 100. percent That's all. Yeah. So nothing to worry about. You're fine. It's just 
Yeah. You're good. And I think that everything would have been fine had she not been sitting there. I agree 100 That we would have been able to, because Jeff was fine. Like, we were talking football stuff, like yeah. fantasy football. He we was were doing it. We were getting a bunch of talking together. Now things are fine. I just think that uh, whatever triggered her, I don't even remember Is now. it guilt? How was she How was she was sitting right there the whole yeah. time. How was she her car while we were sitting there? No, she was honestly on her computer working, and that's like, I well, felt see, like is, we were invading. This is what's scary to me, because guess what? Somebody has to know. Yeah, how did they know we were there? That we were going over there. Which would be no way to know, unless they're watching us or following us. Considering that I see you on the side of the car. Yeah. That is creepy as hell. Do you think we have a stalker now? And they know every time. It's the IRS. Every time. The IRS. Oh, you think you feel like you're you're thinking you're thinking uh so we watch it yeah what's the name of that guy okay. see this song uh oh what the heck Kevin you should know this I made this song I just wanted to say well either way it feel always like feels like somebody's like. watching me so you really think that there's somebody out there paying attention to us and watching us well that's what I that's what yeah. I don't know I mean. Man, that's scary right there, dude. Who else is there? We have, uh, so you're saying that somebody's outside options. when we left. How, that's, that's the thing. It's like, how would somebody know that we went from here mm -hmm. over to there unless they're out? See, that's just like they were sitting on the side of the road. Right. I'm telling you. Somebody sitting there. Yeah. Every, it, like, like, it, couldn't, it couldn't have been like Terry. Like, Terry didn't know. Nobody knew we were going over there. We didn't give him a heads up. Do we need to we change the days high. that we, like, these guys come, we know. Yeah. We, you guys come over Thursdays. Right. Maybe we got to change days up and they know. switching they days were waiting. constantly. They were watching and they were following. And that is creepy. See, that makes me think neighbors too. Right. Because right. neighbors have access here all right. the time to see. If we're going to change days, on. that's going to suck. I mean, Thursday's my right. day. Right. Yeah. Yeah, me too. Jeez. But so neighbors was the first thing Jeff said. We we went over there for insight. Maybe he it. gave us some insight. Oh, it better not be. If it's them, I'll tell you what. There's no way it's them, dude. I, I hope you're joking. I mean, it's not like they're our only neighbors. Like you're, you're being serious? No, I am being yeah. serious because I don't understand who it could possibly be. But it does make sense what they were saying about a neighbor. If they knew we do podcasts and stuff, like been, they're older than me to get all that information. If they're mad at you, they knew you do Oh, it. me and the neighbors don't get along. No, that's definitely true. So, they know you do a podcast. And I don't kill their chickens. No, I just want to say that. Right, right. Because that was messed up that people they did that. They hear us. Shit, but he kills them. They hear I us outside filming. I think we never kill their filming. chicken. <laughs> they hear us outside filming. It was delicious, dude. That's Maybe they've true. had enough. I don't know. Delicious. I'm just saying. I don't know that whole I'm story. Saying, when he says something, I start listening. I got to get away from him for yeah. a minute. I don't, I don't blame you. Kind of bothering me. Okay, so who do you think did it then? I don't think we know who did it. The smart guy. I think no, it's it's somebody that's, smart. that's what's scary. About that's, it. I'm starting to get freaked out now, yeah. dude. Like it's not somebody. Like yeah, they're playful pranks, but there's somebody that's like stalkers. Like how else would they know that we were left here tonight and then they followed us wherever we went? They followed us that's there. Exactly right. And then they waited till we were inside. The only thing I'll say is they were your neighbors. It'd be really us three for that. I didn't know about this guy, up. but now no, it can't be whoever. It can't be you. I mean, no, honestly, it's none of us. It's but he him. just brought a great point. He said, if it was a neighbor, they would know and they would have access all the time when we're coming and going because they're always there. They would have but, first yeah, sight. Are they going to sit outside though, or are they going to be inside their house? Maybe they're looking Dude, at the we're not loud. Know. We're loud and we're here every Thursday. All they gotta do is look out and say, oh, all the cars are out in the parking lot yeah, all they, the time. Are they gonna the say, oh, oh, but they're not gonna know we're leaving to go somewhere. Like, where are we gonna eat? And if follow us to the restaurant and we're gonna have a car there? Maybe. Well, maybe. Um, maybe they were waiting for us to be Were they going to somebody else's property? And that's ballsy. They didn't know who they, they, they your sister they lives did. there? Well, like, no. it's somebody, I mean, it's somebody that knows that's your sister and your family that you wanted to go see. Your neighbors don't know your sister lives right down the road. No, I, like, how do they know that? Like, it's, it, I'm saying it's a fan. Somebody's stalking us. No, that's a, that's a great point also yeah. because it's not like their house is really accessible to get to the to the True, back. Yeah. But are your no, fans they're they're in a car to, ready to go to follow us to get to your brother's? Yeah. Are they in a, that like that privy to like the information where like the, they know? 
where you live? I mean, your neighbors? Yeah, my neighbors. They're like fans. Sure. Now. I'm talking fans. Like, I know. You, it's I mean, actually, no. I know. I'm sorry. No, dude. yes, 100. Yeah, percent they, they do. Because we, yeah. we, yeah, we've, we've had, had our, we've time. had our address put out there a million times. Yeah. I love how you say, yeah, like you've never had a fan come over to your house. Uh, no. I you remember yeah. the first. Podcast yeah, 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 we had, yeah, 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 yeah. we talked about it all. Sure, yeah. There was actually a fan yeah. that was coming out here quite a few times, and he wanted to get together because he was hitting me up in DMs all the time. He wanted to get George? together. George? No. I think his name was Mark. Mark what? And he came to the door one time, and I thought that, that it was kind of suspicious because it was during the pandemic. And I thought yeah, it was kind of suspicious. I haven't heard from him in a while now. Ever since this stuff's been going on. What did you say to him when he stopped by? Did you offend him? I told him, I said, no. Matter of fact, it was back when I was sick during COVID and he stopped by the house. Oh, and I was really? a little freaked out. And I, I stepped back and I said, I said, dude, you can't you can't stop at my house. I thought it was, uh, you know who Mark Locus, Locuson is? Remember? Not, remember he was yeah, but I'm not one of Jesse's friends? I thought it was him because he looked just like oh, him. Oh, I do know who that is. But this dude wasn't him. Cause he hit me up in DMs, and I was like, "Sometime when this pandemic's over, we can get together and stuff." I haven't heard from him. Huh? This is his way of getting back together. They like prank, 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 and all of a sudden he'll come out and say, "Hey, look at me." Uh, now, what's creepy about this is this, show. this means this dude is stalking us. Yeah, yeah. this is above me out. Like, like, if you were a fan, I feel that you should have came out a long time ago. Like right. now, to follow us somewhere to do something here is different. Right. To follow us somewhere and do it there, that's a whole yeah. different story. <laughs> I hope you guys aren't playing us right now. I like I really Why would I be I'll be honest because with you, I'll be honest with you, dude. I wish that because we if were this not good, like then I'm no, gonna, no, no, no. I'm I wish honestly start getting I wish start. we were this good. It would be but by then we would admit this would be the greatest prank ever done. Right, right Larry? Yeah. It was me and you? It's no, greatest no, prank no, ever no. done. I'm gonna show Kevin. I'm gonna show Kevin. I'm gonna show Kevin. Who else do they know that they can get to spray paint the car while everybody is in their house? It definitely was not, dude. Well, actually, it was a while ago since the last time that he hmm. DM'd me. Let me see if I can mm. find him on Man. here. Here he is. This dude. I believe you. I'm like, I'm just trying to like this dude right navigate here. all avenues. His name is Mark. Right? Top of the But wait a second. Let me show you. Suspicious. This is when he was hitting me up. Just want to shoot a video. Want to be part of the vlog? Oh. Hey, and I were going to shoot a video tomorrow. What? Wow. And I kept, I kept kind of like pushing him off on this. This guy came on strong too. Yeah. And I told him, I said, some maybe sometime in July, like the I mean, third he's writing week. paragraphs and you're giving him like two sentence yeah. answers. Wow, that's interesting, dude. Yeah. I mean, the fact that they're hmm. trying to be in videos hmm. is one way to guarantee them to get in their videos. That last name yeah. seems made up too. Because if it was him, he'd come out and say, hey, it was us, we'd probably do a video on it. I think we have a stalker on our hands. 